Well, the traveling exhibition marking the lives lost and sacrifices made on September 11th is in Raleigh this weekend. The stop is part of a multi-city tour to build support for the National September 11th Memorial and Museum at the site of the World Trade Center. The sound of bagpipes fills the air over Nash Square at the opening ceremony for the September 11th Memorial and Museum Tour. Outside, local first responders and people who lost loved ones during the suicide attacks in America six years ago. You know, it's an, very emotional for me, I think. Uh, in many ways, this is, a, this is a great tribute from the, from the people of the United States to the people of the United States. It's very important. He wrote this message to his brother on a beam that will help support the museum when it's built. Inside the exhibit, reminders of the sacrifices made that day to save people like Keating Crown. He escaped the second tower you know, I, before it fell. At the end of the day, I got very lucky. For whatever reason, I was able to survive the impact and was able to survive um, getting out of, the, out of the building. He likes the plans on display here for the memorial in Lower Manhattan. This design, um, it's fluid and it's living. And um, it really, and, you know, the way it shows the footprint of the towers um, really shows the importance of remembering that day and remembering what our country went through. Raleigh is the second stop on this tour, so there's plenty of room left on the beam for more messages and signatures. Tour organizers hope you'll think about coming down here and adding yours. Survivors and people mourning loved ones killed that day also urge you to experience this while it's here. Because it's, it's, it's about more than just those, again, who were lost. It's about uh, what happened to this country, and we need to remember that. And you will find that in downtown Raleigh, right opposite the number one fire station. Very moving.